Hi, I'm Peter Zatlukul, Vice President of Engineering for Xnor.ai. Greetings from Embedded Vision 2019. I'm going to show you a little bit of what we have at the booth this year. Um, so Xnor is a company that specializes in highly optimized deep learning models and deep learning model software that can run on the most constrained devices uh, on the edge out there. For example, this is a Raspberry Pi Zero running one of Xnor's optimized models doing person detection DNN at eight frames a second, something you normally wouldn't expect to see on a 50 cent CPU. We have the same model over here running at over 30 frames a second on an Ambarella S5L, also in CPU, uh, on an ARM Cortex A53 core processor. Um, also at the show this year, we're really excited to announce ai to go a new software platform and SDK that allows developers to quickly embed models pre-built by Xnor, highly optimized for your edge AI case with a tuned inference engine for a variety of hardware targets. We're expanding the number of targets possible for embedded developers to use, starting with embedded Linux, Linux desktop, Mac OS, and coming soon, we're going to have the mobile OS's, iOS, Android, and um, NVIDIA's TX2 platform. ai to go is simple to use. A developer typically starts by selecting their industry case, uh, choosing the kind of model that's suitable for the AI task they're solving, and then tuning their model for their specific constraints, optimizing for how much memory footprint and working set there is, and their latency needs and FPS targets. Using our scatterplot tuning tool, you can then pick the most optimal model uh, sorted by relative uh, accuracy and embed that model into your solution in as quickly as five minutes. We're also excited to demonstrate an FPGA solution running a 32 frame per second deep neural network doing a person detection AI task at state of the art accuracy using only 48 milliwatts of energy. This is sufficiently small that with a solar harvester, you could run a device like this indefinitely with a narrow band connection back to a controller indicating uh, whether objects have been detected. And that's it. Uh, thank you very much for listening. Please visit xnor.ai if you're interested in learning more information.